Welcome back to the iOS and Mac management video series where we're looking at setting up and configuring Apple devices to be managed by Microsoft Intune. Now if you followed the series along so far you would notice that I already have a video which shows you manually adding a device to Apple Business Manager using the Configurator app on a Mac device. I also wrote a blog to show you how you do that and manually add a device using the Configurator app from an iPhone. So check that out in the links. But I did get some comments back and in my experience, it does show that this is far easier doing it on an iPhone. So in this video, we're gonna concentrate on how you quickly set it up and register your device with Apple Business Manager. So let's get started. So here on the screen, I've got both my devices and you will need to have these devices physically next to each other to perform this. I've got my iPhone on the left um, and obviously my MacBook Air on the right here. Now I've got this device, which is, it's a new MacBook Air. However, it has been uh, previously registered for personal use. So when you have an existing device, you will need to wipe that device initially. Um, then, if you go through and set up a new device, it will go through the setup assistant initially. So let's go through the process of doing this. Firstly, on the Mac uh, device, you're gonna need to register the, to the Wi-Fi. This is a prerequisite in order to kind of initially set this up. So I join my local Wi-Fi. And for m in my case, because it's been registered previously, I'm gonna restart the device. And it should restart in the Apple setup assistant. So there you have it, so it's starting that. Now, in this case, I'm gonna progress through the language and then for the region. And at this point, I'm gonna start the Configurator app on the iPhone and search on next to the device. So it's telling me to add the device. Now, I haven't logged on to this um, application, so it's gonna prompt me to do that, and I need to do that in order to get the authentication onto Apple Business Manager. So once I've done that, after scanning through the camera on the Apple device, it may prompt you for two-factor authentication, which it did for me, and that's it, right? The device will now start adding this Mac device onto Apple Business Manager, and there you have it. It's as quick as that. Now, that's my reasoning for saying it's easier. So just to show the, um, the finish of this, we're gonna log into the Apple Business Manager, a tenant that I have here, and actually show that it's registered, okay? So we do that with my uh, permissions on Apple Business Manager. I'm gonna to go to the devices, and then I'm gonna filter it on the Apple Configurator, because that's the way we added it, okay? Uh, and there's my device, the MacBook Air. Now, at this point, it's not linked to any Intune server, so I can hit the edit the server assignment, and then I could go through and select it there. So that's it for this quick video. Hopefully I've answered some of the questions that have been posed, but also helped you along the way in registering your devices. Thanks very much.